How close was he? It was just just beside my tent. Yeah. <laughs> he woke me up. And then I was, he ran in the wood and he's still there. <laughs> Every summer, tree planters from coast to coast prove that there is hope in the face of climate change. These hardworking young Canadians donate their earnings to help plant trees and so much more on the island of Pemba. When we first started, Pemba communities were in dire states. I was a tree planter for four years before we started Community Forest International and now I work for the organization doing communications and outreach. There's a reason why we, we have to plant like a lot of trees. <laughs> one we plant it to make more money <laughs> and the other one we plant it to give to Pamba. Yeah. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah. So we plant lots of trees, yeah? My name is um, Nelly. Everybody calls me Nelly Man. I've been donating right now for six years now. I love doing it. You know, what I saw is what moved me. No shoes, no planting bags. That really moved me a lot. I was shocked first to see young ladies and gentlemen support purchasing of material for tree nursery establishment to carry some seedling from the nursery and send them to the field for planting trees. What we do at Community Forest International is to supply the materials and the training to help Pembins empower themselves. In the beginning we started with trees, but since then we've moved into other areas like rainwater harvesting, beekeeping, agroforestry. We help build a school, solar microgrid so people can have power, students can study at night. <laughs> The bugs are bad today, man. This is for Pimba and all the other trees I'm gonna bag out today. Kind of what I've come to the conclusion of is when you come from a position of such privilege, it's your duty to give back. Because it's one thing to give money to a charity, it's another to see the results of where the money went and see what a difference you can actually make for these people. Like it started with the trees and then it just, just brought up all these other things and they're just like solving their problems like the water and electricity and the whole ecosystem they're building on their island is awesome. The more trees I play, the more I can give the Pemba. Like I really like what Pemba's doing in terms of um, how sustainable what they're, making, what they're making is. You know, it's owned by the people, not by some company. So it's a really cool approach. It's absolutely incredible to see what these communities have done with so little. And that's the great thing about the Plant for Pemba campaign is 100% of the funds raised through this campaign go directly to, help, to helping Pemba communities. It is hard for some people who have never tree planted to actually understand the experience. Uh, okay. If people outside of tree planting could see that, you know, we're working hard to help other people, that I think that message would uh, stick with them. I usually donate my full day's pay. Hopefully, like, after seeing the work we do, maybe motivate you guys to even do some of your day or your full day, whatever it is, just to help out some people who could really use it. I'm, I'm taking this opportunity to say it's important for me to thank them on behalf of our Pemba community because we know the importance of this support from them. There are so many people who are care for Pemba community. I thank you all who have donated their funds 
for the Pemba community. It's absolutely amazing just like the work that you guys have done and like if we can support that even just like a little bit like one day's worth and it's just like well you know what am I going to spend that one day's worth on like this is something that will help so many people out like we're a community and so are they right and it's just when you're out here all you've got is each other and that's all they've got on that island is each other right? Yeah, some really really generous people. Our goal with the Plant for Pemba campaign is to match every single dollar that these Canadian tree planters are, are contributing with people from around the world who are passionate, who care about helping vulnerable communities adapt to climate change. My crew is giving everything we earn today to No Pemba. way. Whole crew. No. It's only four people, but to me. That's insane, man. Huh. Wow. What'd you say, JT? My whole crew is giving everything.